What's up guys, so in today's video I'm going to show you the best best deck that you can use in Clash Royale. This deck is so good that it will probably get you banned. <laughs> Not really, I'm just joking. But for reals, I do recommend you use this deck. I think I was doing a, th uh, a 3 times elixir challenger, uh, but first of all I had to start off with the poison, just wanted to do some chip damage. I did see that he had a wizard so I could have placed the poison on the wizard and he also fired ball my my bomber tower but uh, I did want to log just to get that wizard out of the way I did place another bomb tower just because I didn't want to do any chip damage those elite barbarians are very very tough uh, I did use the Royal Knights ability early here because I wanted to get some chip damage to this building and I placed uh, a poison which did some really good damage and he did place a wizard here and I was I, I had a cycle to my royal knight so what I did was I placed my flying machine but he did fireball it uh, while I had placed my bomb tower which did put me in a very difficult spot but I did use my royal knight's ability right here just so I could do some damage to the wizard and my phoenix would be able to take it out now I did place this poison a little bit too early because I could have taken out that was with the poison but I did minor it just uh, to do some chip damage and I did place a log in order to take it out because it will give you some problems if you use this deck. And here I did start having some trouble and I started panicking because he did fireball and I was expecting major damage but I got really lucky that Miner got there just in time. Uh, he did place down the wizard here and I decided to place a poison like I said it does really good chip damage to the wizard with the poison and I did some nice nice damage here uh, the leap barbs I did see that the Phoenix uh, had uh, spawned the egg and uh, that caused the the, bar the leap barbarians to go and rush my um, royal knight but I did do some really good damage uh, we got another problem because he did place elite barbarians and the wizard I did use my ability in order for the royal knight to take out the wizard he did fireball but goblins came in clutch uh, again he placed down the wizard but with minor already doing some damage here I could just place down the poison and take out his tower that is a GG's there 20 seconds on the clock I gotta use Royal Knight's ability in order to take out the wizard. Now I did place Bomb Tower here just so a good defense right here. Now with 10 seconds on the clock, uh, I just needed to get no damage so I logged it. Easy. GG's my guy. Good game. Gotta give a little peace. Now my next opponent did place down Musketeer and I was expecting a 2.6 Hog Rider deck but then I saw Valkyrie and Pekka so I wasn't really worried. Uh, you know, everyone using a uh, 2.6 Hog Rider deck. Very annoying deck. Now, I did start lagging here a little bit. That's why I had to place the bomb tower right in front. Uh, but, you know, we came in clutch. No major damage. Peace sign right here. Uh, and it was pretty much like this. I do place Miner in order to see what cards they're going to place. Or just to see what cards they haven't placed. And here, I got very, very lucky with Goblins doing enough damage to the musketeer my royal knight does connect uh he doesn't place anything else that is a ggs my opponent did give up after this now for this match i was a little bit worried because my opponent did have giant and it, that's a very uh, a very scary card if you place it with wizard and witch and he, in this case he did have both but uh, I was determined to win. I wasn't going let to him, let him beat me. Uh, so I d Miner did get a little late to the party there. Uh, I was hoping Miner would uh, take out Musketeer. That way uh, it wouldn't cause any damage. But I did place Bomb Tower here. And I should have placed something else in order to save my Bomb Tower for the Giant. Uh, I did place Royal Knight here just to do a little, little, do a little bit of chip damage. I do Poison in order to take out those pesky Minion Horde. Uh, again, uh, Miner gets late to the party and does not, uh, he just gets very lucky in order to take out the Musketeer uh, for the Goblins. Um, he does place Wizard again and Minions, expecting another Giant, uh, I had to move 
quickly and think fast so i did use my rolling ice ability in order to take out the wizard because wizard is very uh is a very big problem for this deck but poison and i do a lot of damage that's tower one uh with 29 seconds on the clock he starts panicking starts placing wizard down minion hordes and everything uh, i started panicking too in order to cycle to my poison to take out the minion horde i get really lucky here just place the bomb tower just because i can so yeah guys i do recommend you use this deck it is really really nice um i will write down the deck um in the description i will put it down there uh i was gonna tell you guys in the previous video but i guess i'll just tell you right now 1000 likes and i would do a face reveal but only if this video gets a thousand likes so i hope you guys have a wonderful night day evening whatever peace